2 now. We have breaking news. Our crew just arrived on the scene of a deadly apartment fire in DeKalb County. Atlanta News First, Madeline Montgomery is live at the Creekside Corner Apartments in Stonecrest. Madeline, what are you learning? It's just a really scary situation. We just heard from DeKalb Fire, and they were saying that there is a dead man inside this apartment. I'm actually right now with a woman whose daughter lives in that apartment and was inside at the time of the fire. And you say this is a really complicated situation. Yeah, it's very complicated. Um, he set the kitchen on fire uh, this early this morning and tried to kill her and the baby. But they got out. He tried to hold her in there, but she ended up getting out. He set himself on fire. She tried to get him to jump off the balcony, but he begged her to come back and he just walked back into the fire and just killed himself and she heard his screams and that was it and how did you hear about this did she um, call you she called me she was calling my phone while i was at work i was working and i'm here and have you been able to talk to her your grandchild yeah, she's over there in the car uh, very upset and hurt you know that he did this to himself more hurt that he tried to kill her and her baby and had there been issues before that you knew about? Well, the only thing I know about him, he had a little mental issue. You know, he had a little problem, you know what I'm saying? But not to this extent I think he would kill himself or try to harm her and the baby. And are you impressed with how fast Fire was able to get here and make sure everything was okay? Yeah, everything was here when I got here. I'm just thankful that she's alive, her and the baby. I'm just happy for that. And how old is her baby? Oh, she's five. They, that's the only child they have together. Mm -hmm. And, I mean, where where does your family go moving forward from this? Um, she's going to have to move. She's probably going to have to come to my house for a little while till she get another apartment because, obviously, I think that one is totally lost. Was she able to get anything out? Or? Nothing right now. Nothing. They're not letting her come in. And, I mean, just what what do you have to say about this situation i'm just hurt that he that he's gone i just saw him when yesterday he was normal everything no problem I, i'm just confused that why he would do something like this i know he had a little issue but not to this extent to like want to hurt your child and your child's mother nor yourself that's bad to go and set your own cell phone fire and go back in there and this, these people heard his scream they like they heard him just screaming and he still just did it and she did her best to try to get him out. She begged him to jump over the balcony, and he just turned his back and walked back in the fire. That was it. We're live. All right, thank you so much for talking to us. So we are talking to DeKalb County Fire, and they say that an arson investigator is coming out and that law enforcement will be involved depending on what they find inside of that apartment. And this only affected one apartment in this apartment complex, so everybody else has been able to stay in their homes at this early hour. For now, reporting live in Stonecrest, I'm Madeline Montgomery, Atlanta News First. Man, I got to tell you, Matt.